my high. <laughs> oh my God. Hallelujah. I've been on a journey so long. And I am not going to come down. It's a beautiful journey. Yes. Serving God is not a plaything. He's a real, real, real as night and day. And you know, sometimes God do use some things to test us and we think that he means us harm, but he don't mean us any harm. He's great and his name is worthy to be praised. If I could tell you all that I've been through where I am and where I am now, you would be surprised. He had some rough hedge to carry us through. And when, us, when he bring us through them, when we are going through them, it brings sorrow, it brings pain. But when you come through them, it is a blessing. Yes. I was out in the world and I didn't know about God. I was working in the craft market. And one day, a lady invited me to church. And I go that Sunday. And God sent an evangelist lady at that church. And she sings. And I tell you, I feel something moving me like a electric city. <laughs> it was good. And I shout. I was a person that full of pride. I shout and I said, Hallelujah. And from that Sunday upward till now, I am a changed person. Because the word of God said, if any man be in Christ, is a new creature. All things are passed away and the old, all things become new. I repented for my sin, confess them, repent and turn away from them. And 92, I get baptized, I get saved. You can count in many years now. Year 2000, and appointed 92, I baptized get saved and i be a witness in this country i preach around the 14 parishes of this country one in jamaica land we love not with my own strength but with the strength of god because by our strength we are a failure and with the strength of god i read different scriptures to back up what i was doing and when god sent me out day by day that's what i do and since 92 upward till this day, I still tell him Jamaica land we love. That God love us with a perfect love. We are a chosen vessel for him. We are a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a peculiar people. We were made to praise him. We were made to love him. We were made to live holy and honest. But because we go astray, he had to call back us. He's jealous for us. Yes, he had to punish us, chastise us, reprimand us like our father would beat his child if he has done anything or his children to bring us back to him. Yes, so from that day I become a child of God walking each day with him. Learn to depend upon him, learn to wait upon him. And everything that I do or said, I depend upon him totally. So here am I to tell you that God love you, Jamaica. Regardless of the plague that let out at this time, the sickness, the disease, I not even call his name. Because sometimes when you call him, you may feel strength, strength. It is us for us to stand flat-footed and be strengthened in God. And know that he is God. And there is none one like him, so mighty, so great. No care how the scientists bad. No care how technology bad. No care the government force harm is powerful. It's not powerful like my God. When he moves, everything moves. When he stands still, everything stands still. And he don't have to be in Jamaica land or anywhere else to rule the world. He stay right here. He's where he is in his kingdom doing great and marvelous work. Yes, he's the same God that caused the children of Israel to go through the Red Sea when Pharaoh and his army captured them. 
is the same God when Nebuchadnezzar threw Daniel's in the ne in the pit. He's the same God. He's the same God from Genesis to Revelation, and He never changed. And He's out to pull us up that we will realize that he can do all things. So I'm here to let you know that he changed me in this land, Jamaica land we love. And that he changed me because I used to do anything that you are out there doing. I used to do it and do it worse. And God changed me. I used to wear my hair during. I used to wear my short catch on top of my bottom. I used to wear my tights. I used to cream my hair. I used to use hamby. I used to use bleaching cream. I used to use all those things. And now it is like nothing to me because the Bible said it beautified the meek with salvation. So don't believe that you are gone too far to return to God because he know how to get you. So today I am rejoicing. I'm rejoicing. Hallelujah. The word of God says, What shall separate us from the love of God which is in Christ Jesus? So nothing must separate us. Just love God. Read your Bible. When you get up, read your Bible. Pray, give God thanks. For every meal that you put in your mouth, you give God thanks. Every water that you drink, everything that you do, learn to give thanks. Because nothing is greater than breathing the breath of life. God is good. Love you, Jamaica. <laughs> Love you, Jamaica, Jamaicans, I love you. This is our country and we love it. And no gates of hell can destroy Jamaica land we love.